All right, so this is Wednesday, October 5th, college football. Good week we had last week in college football as well as tennis. Hit most of our plays on everything. Uh, didn't have any NFL games last week. I didn't really like the board. Didn't see the board well, so I didn't put out any videos. But we got some plays this week. Um, so we have this college game on Wednesday, Central Florida and SMU here. Central Florida opened up as a three and a half point favorite. It's uh, currently holding around three, three and a half. Money line is opened up quite high from what I expected. It's opened up at 170 right now. Uh, and that's due to the fact that Central Florida has been playing well, winning three out of their last four matches, games in blowout fashion 27 10 against Georgia Tech, 40 to 14 against Florida. Florida Atlantic. They play their first conference game here against SMU as well as SMU plays their first conference game. Um, SMU just came off of two losses, close losses to TCU and Maryland in high scoring games. Uh, my prediction on this game is going to be on SMU. I feel like they're going to play a lot better defense in this match up against Central Florida. This game's going to slow down. I feel like the total is set at 65 and a half here. The reason why it's high is because you know, they gave up 42 and 34 and Central Florida has been blowing out opponents. So, I feel like that's going to change and I feel like we're going to get an under here with SMU. And I'm also leaning toward SMU. I like SMU at the plus three and a half in this matchup. I feel like that money line is just a little bit too high. Uh, and these teams are not that much uh, separate. They're not that far apart from each other. SMU definitely can beat Central Florida here. Um, I feel like their defense is going to step up and they're going to slow the game down. And that's going to also um, help the under as well. Because I don't think they're going to go up and down the field you know, back and forth. I don't think SMU wants to play that way, knowing that they've lost the last two games. They're going to have to play some defense in this game. So my play is going to be on SMU at plus three and a half as well. I have a bigger lean on the side than I do the total, but I do like the total here. Uh, 65 and a half has dropped to 64. So 64 and a half so the sharp money is taking the under in this game already because the public doesn't bet on unders very rarely and they don't bet unders when the totals opened up this high so sharp money is taking the under uh already so i would take this back up to 65 and a half and my lean is also on smu at plus three and a half so that's going to be my place for this game. So I'll be back with some more videos. So comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you then.